What the hell were you doing on a boat on Tampa Bay in the middle of horrific thunderstorms at like 6.30 p.m. yesterday? What is the matter with you guys? Okay, hold on. Before you even address that, I talked to Roxanne yesterday about 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah. And for some reason, it felt appropriate to have mundane, friendly chit-chat. Yeah, that was weird when you did that. It was. I was like, so... And the conversation was over, but I said, so why did you speak to her at one o'clock yesterday? We had a morning show matter we had to address. Uh, more, anything that I need to be aware of? I can't even remember nah, right you'll, now. You'll, you'll find out when it all turns to hell. Anyway, but- uh, Oh, great. So, listen, oh, really? Are, are, you, are you yanking my chain? The information's given to you on a need-to-know basis oh, on some matters. This right. is one of them. Anyway, <laughs> uh, Roxanne and I are going over great. there. I, I kind of lay it out for her, and then yep. we, the conversation was over. Mm-hmm. But for some reason, I felt compelled to say, so- what do you have planned the rest of the day? Oh, and that's she, creepy small right? talk. I know. Uh, that's I, I wanted to hang up. Fester's sh- turning creepy. Well, it's, it's, just, <laughs> it's like you texting Michelle. Yeah. Or it's, it's, so, yeah. Oh, yeah. Stop texting my wife. Oh, her and I have a whole textual thing going on yeah, right now. Yeah, te- uh. te- yeah textual so, well, relationship. Well, listen, so then Roxanne says this verbatim. She goes, oh, well, I'm almost home. I'm going to take a quick nap. And then i got to record some stuff. And then I'm going to pick up the kids. And then... I'm going to be on a boat. We're going to take a boat ride from from somewhere in South Tampa to Tierra Verde on some on some boat. I was like, on a boat in the evening? I was like, you know, it rains in the evening. And she's like, oh, yeah, it's just a small thing, though. It's just us and like like four couples. <laughs> four yeah. couples. Like four, it's like a four couple Big thing. Biggest is both. No kids. Just four They're, couples So on I boat. call Roxanne because I had some show business uh, not to uh, ask her creepy questions. <laughs> no, All right. about what she so, was up to. I, so what do you have planned? I mean, I, the conversation should have been over 20 seconds ago, but no. I, I had something I wanted Roxanne to work on. And she says, hey, I, she texts me back, hey, I can't talk now, I'm boating. And I'm, I'm looking up, <laughs> wait, I'm looking up, seriously, I had just finished my afternoon show, it's like 6.30 p.m., and we are getting rocked in South Tampa. Now, listen, I live on Tampa Bay, and we're getting rocked. I mean, the th- we're getting the lightning strikes and the thunder hitting almost immediately, and... And Roxanne sends me a picture, can't talk now, it's too noisy, I'm boating. And then she sends me a picture of the bow of the boat looking out over Tampa Bay, and there's these ominous clouds. I'm like, what the hell? Do do you see what I I texted you? Hold on a minute. Hey, let me me go, I'm going to read you what my texts were. So here's my text exchange. And... uh, Roxanne sends, so I call her, she didn't pick up, then she sends me a text on a boat with a smiley face emoji with the eyes like all googly and the tongue hanging out. (laughs) That's my favorite. And then she sends me a picture of her on the boat, and I'm looking at the most ominous clouds, and then she texted back, it's loud, I'll call you when I get some quiet on a boat, and then I text back. You're on a boat on the water in the middle of these storms? And then you text back, this is true. And then I wrote, this is true. Then I wrote back, who's the genius that decided this was a good idea? And then Roxanne texts back, that's what Doug keeps asking me. (laughs) So what the hell were you guys doing on a boat with other people in the middle of really rough Early evening thunderstorms last night. Well, my friend invited us, and so then we were driving there, and this is like 5 o'clock, and it's absolute downpour, lightning and thunder everywhere, and Doug's like, you do realize this is dangerous. You do realize this is a bad idea. And he's so <laughs> negative the whole way. And I'm like, can, co- why would you can, go? Can you please act like you first met me? Would you be this negative? Because I wouldn't want to date oh my, you if you were this negative oh to me when I first met you. Because he doesn't want to go. On, he, so he doesn't want to go on a small boat on on the water in the middle of horrific I'm like, late afternoon, early evening summer thunderstorms in the Tampa Bay area. He was being very negative about it. Oh uh, well, and I would I, I would be negative about it as well. I wouldn't let. I wouldn't let me and yeah, I mean, don't uh, can go. you put, put a sentence together? 
Just don't go. That's your captains usually check the weather. So, My God. So, so you said that friends invited you? Yeah, so friends yeah. invited us. So yeah. then- I think there's another story about that. Oh, look at the Right back and you'll hear yeah. a tale, hey. a tale of a faithful Yeah, a tale of a faithful trip. started from this tropic port aboard this tiny ship. Yeah, from ship. South Tampa. The mate was a mighty sailing man, the skipper brave yeah, and sure. Yeah, and the, the weather started getting rough. Set sail that day for a three. How, how long were you out? Was it a three-hour tour? It was a three-hour tour. Three-hour tour. Here we go. Here we go. Roxanne and Doug were tossed. All right, there we go. All right, quick question. Yeah. Is Roxanne the movie star or Miss Howell? Well, how about Best Mary theory. Ann? She's not Mary Ann. I think she's, she's more Mary Ann. Oh, no, no, she's not Mary Ann. Oh, I think she, she is not Mary so wait, you're going she with, is not Mary So you're going with Roxanne's either the movie star Ginger or... Or the shriveled up old bag? <laughs> Which one is she? She's one of the two. Thanks, Master. I mean, oh god. I mean, who but, are you? I mean, I'd be. I, who's a, who's a fat guy? Skipper. Skipper. I'm Skipper. Yeah, I'm Skipper. Who's the fat guy? <laughs> I, I haven't watched Wait, Gilligan Island. Well, you, in- there's a weight <laughs> limit on the boat. All right, so, oh. so Roxanne, is that your joke? Is that your insult to did me? Did you want to add any more to your horrifically bad decision to go boating in the middle of a rough storm yesterday? It, it got better, like we sailed or boated into clear skies. You weren't sailing, <laughs> and um, they're like on an eighteen foot boat. No, it was bigger than that. It had to have been bigger than that. Uh, how big was the boat? I think it was fifty. 50? It was a yacht? That wasn't, it was, it, uh, it's not 50 feet. I'm looking at the bow of this thing. It, it might be a 28 foot of tops. It's not a 50 foot yacht. 50 feet. Well, it had like an indoor uh, uh, section. And Jeff uh, Bezos' yacht. Yeah, Roxanne, listen, I've come to know you over the last couple of years since you joined the MJ Morning Show team. And you make some really crappy decisions. I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. and, and well, this one just isn't who's, safe. Who's sitting here having a lovely morning? You ever That's, hear like a small, a small craft night. advisory in effect, and you know that kind it's of 50 stuff? Fifty feet. It was that it. boat was not fifty <laughs> feet. I, I need to get. Oh, okay, well, clearly I'm not good at gauging. You got a measurement feet. problem. I do have a measurement problem. Yeah. it's been proven in the past. However, yeah. I had a great time and. That was, and I did get absolutely like walking from my car to the boat on the dock. It was like the last one and I got completely soaked and it was very dangerous. So you got onto the boat in the middle of the storm? Yeah. Both of of us were like completely drenched and Doug hating my guts. Well, why didn't Doug put his foot down and say, we're not going on a boat in the middle of a storm last night? Because it was my decision. Like I said, uh, you make some poor decisions.